met him. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is that uh, from the app how you got to know him? Hello. Okay, okay. From the app. <laughs> from the app. <laughs> okay, you want to repeat that again? <laughs> Hello, everyone. There has been a rise in dating apps locally and regionally. In Singapore alone, there are more than 10 different dating apps available for you to choose from. Singapore lifestyle can get pretty hectic and most people doesn't have time to meet new people. So most of them will turn to dating apps. Is it really possible to find your true love on dating apps today? We are here in Orchard to find out. Let's go. You said you used before, yeah. right? Yeah. Five years ago? Five years ago. Yeah. Some. Some. Yeah. Used before. Okay. So now, not using anymore. Yeah. For yourself? Yeah, I don't use it. Currently, not anyone that I know. Okay. Yeah. yeah, last time, like seven years ago. Uh, Tinder, Grinder, Bagel meets coffee. Uh, coffee means coffee means uh, bigger. Yeah. <laughs> Tinder. Tinder. Uh, Madu. Uh, 之前有用过 Tinder. Uh, 还有中国的一些 oh. app. I use Tinder. Yes, I've used is Tinder. Considered a dating app. Yes, of course. Yes, <laughs> yes, I've used oh. it before. I'm mostly familiar with just Tinder. I just use the WeChat. 有一点点，因为我现在男朋友就是在 dating app 上面认识的，然后我跟别人介绍的时候会有一点尴尬。别人会觉得说你是不是被骗了哦你还在用这种东西 uh, oh, They tend to like judge you desperate or something why you really need to use an app like dating site to meet person No I don't think so I think now it's more and more common for people to find genuine connections on dating apps yeah. Initially yes <laughs> Initially yes like what Tinder you know like this I a lot of people feel they go to that extreme when they are lifeless or they mm. cannot find anybody and that's the extreme that they go to but it's not bad at all like you know you never know you might meet people abroad across the world as well to find someone nice they want to meet new people so they're looking for a boyfriend girlfriends find their true love <laughs> also is this r21 yeah. for love to look for love getting to know more friends find someone yeah, their partner just <laughs> think 跟陌生人聊聊天之类的就是结交多一点朋友先 Before I don't have friends when I stayed in So I was looking for friends Then I knew him <laughs> The pictures and what they're doing in the pictures can give you a sense of their personality uh, Their jobs, if they have a similar hobbies If their looks are <laughs> what, they, what the girls like of, of course first is the profile picture, handsome or not Personality, uh, how they continue the conversation, appearance. Yeah. yeah, you know when someone try too hard, you can tell. Yeah, they don't try so hard. Flex their muscles <laughs> and like, oh, I say they reach and all that kind. Of <laughs> yeah. Oh, face. Handsome, of course, and tall. His looks, of course. His picture, <laughs> definitely. Six to seven years old, right? Just too big, I don't think about it. Look at the photos. 然后要辨别一下照片有可能会不会是假的 Maybe for me, I'm more attracted to more sporty looking guys Not those douchebag kind of like flex here, flex there kind of But more like, you know You can see like aura, like first pictures la The name, if it's easy to read <laughs> I think mostly the bad one the First date, talking about money already More, maybe very niao we have no conversation with each other. It's just a very awkward like dinner. Then I'll stop talking <laughs> with that person. Yeah. You get to meet other person, expand your friend negatively. Like some really take advantage of it. One night stand mm -hmm. and such. It's rare that you're gonna be finding some true person, real person there. 好处是就是可可以。比较快速的看很多人的讯息，然后包括去选你比较中意的，然后而且就是听的它是双向的嘛，然后如果你对男生有意思，然后但人家对你没有意思的话，也不会很尴尬。坏处的话，有些人会有一些假的信息在上面
some of them good, some of them bad. Like they want to go hotel like <laughs> very fast. After they tell me like that, I ignore already. People are not really honest about what they want. Okay. You know, when they go into it, they say they want A, B, C, but actually they want D, E, F. Okay. So you don't get honesty. And uh, pros is you get to meet people that you might not meet on a daily basis. All right. I have a boyfriend now. Yeah, I know him from uh, online app, dating app. Oh. Yeah. Almost two years. <laughs> yes for me. I think yes. Uh, based on what I, I'm seeing, like, especially for her. Because like, I, I know quite a few people who actually got together with their boyfriend mm. or girlfriend through online dating apps uh, and it's going well, so like, like her. I think now everyone's quite familiar and it, it doesn't seem like that odd if, if people who met on the apps get married. So yeah, yeah I think it's possible. Uh, yes, because I met him. <laughs> yeah, it's possible. It's my first try that I met him. The first person you met on the app is him. Yeah. <laughs> he looked very happy, very delighted you say that. I think you should be able to. The first is that you need to be able to see which is real and which is fake. Because I think this way is still easier to get to know two people's interests. You know, it's possible. Give it a try. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Yeah. 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 Met their spouse online. I think so. You think so? Yeah. All right. Yeah, some of my friends. Oh, so they find so. love in the you know dating site. Of course, as long as they remain true to one another. I got married to the guy I found in Tinder. <laughs> Be yourself, lor. Be yourself, but not too much. I guess. <laughs> uh, they shouldn't like write fake things in order to show themselves better. They should express who they actually really are. If you meet them and they're like a different person, um, I wouldn't want to meet them anymore. Be daring. <laughs> Just make the first move. If... Why your eyes open so big? <laughs> <laughs> Just make your first move if you feel like you really like that person or interested. You have to make sure that they find a, a correct one, lah. So were you daring when you? <laughs> yeah, when I you... made the first move. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I think ultimately it's not to be too dependent on the app to find like your true love. Just cause, pressure. yeah, peer pressure, just cause everyone around you is doing it. Just, uh, yeah, be yourself and just be frank la, if you have any intentions. Don't be excited to the girls because some of the girls they just want to have fun. Only. Obviously to be yourself because once you meet the person in real life, it's it gets a lot more difficult to pre pretend to be someone that you're not. Firstly, just be honest, you know. Do not be ashamed of yourself, whatever it could be. Like, you know, just be honest. You never know there could be somebody else out there accepting you the way you are. Just be honest. But uh, pictures also matter a lot, right? Pictures also matter, yeah. Make sure you use the right picture, yes, for sure. Wow, that's really interesting interviews we did back there. So what do you think? Do you believe women in Singapore are able to find their true love on dating apps today? Leave your comments below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!